guys, welcome back to my channel and today I'm just going to be showing you a DIY that is good for a whiteboard. So I'm going to be telling you the steps, well, the materials you're going to need and yeah. So let's go. Okay, so what you're going to need is a pair of scissors. Then you're going to need a sponge, a new sponge or an old sponge. It doesn't matter, just as long as you have a sponge. Some tape clear tape or you can use the like duct tape and a paper towel so what you're gonna need to do for this is you're going to need to like try and wrap it around like try and find the size okay like that see I found the size make sure you tighten it and then you want to see how I found like the size so now you want to put tape like directly in the middle, no matter where it is, just put tape anywhere where it's like hard to so see. I put tape so it can stay. And then get your scissors and cut at like where like it is, you know? Where it's like you know, you probably don't know what I mean. Or some of you probably do, but um Oh, okay, so then you want to cut it even more, like trim it even more, I guess, if you want, like, but, yeah. This is like the worst one ever, okay. And then, you want to cut the other side if you want, or you can just fold it over either way you want, but I, am, I cut this side, so I guess I'm going to fold this side over. And remember, you have to tape it. So, yeah. And then there. And then there you have it. There's your, like, eraser for your whiteboard. Like, if you don't have one of them. You can make yours better, way better than this. But mine was just in a hurry. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video anyway. And make sure you give it a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And I'll see you all later. Bye.